Alright, so I had a request to do uh, question 16 here. This is from test 9 of the SAT uh, practice test released by the College Board. It's also found in um, the October 2017 exam. So this is question 16 from the calculator section, so section 4 there. It says, in the expression above, uh, A is a constant. If the expression is equivalent to B of X, where B is a constant, what is the value of B? Okay. So first off, they're telling us this expression is equivalent to b of x, meaning it equals b of x. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that out here first. So I'm going to rewrite this. 4x plus 4 times ax minus 1 minus x squared plus 4. That's going to equal bx. All right, next thing here, I'm going to go ahead and distribute this through or FOIL this out. So I'll get here that becomes 4ax squared minus 4x plus 4ax, and then minus 4, and then I'm just going to bring this all down. So minus x squared plus 4 equals bx. All right, so I'm going to combine any like terms that I can. So a negative 4 and a positive 4 will cross out there. So that leaves me with 4ax squared minus 4x plus 4ax um, minus x squared has to equal bx. Now, I want you to notice here that we need both sides to be equal, but my left-hand side has x squared terms on it. So it has a 4ax squared, and it has a minus 1x squared. But if I need that to be equal to my right-hand side here, well, I need those to become 0, because this is really like bx plus 0x squared. So I need the left side to equal the right-hand side. So I need 4ax squared minus x squared to equal 0. So I'm going to go ahead and try to solve this out. So I can go ahead and factor out an x squared, and then I'll get 4a minus 1 equals 0. And then I'm just going to go ahead and set that equal to 0 to solve for a. So technically I could tee this off. So either, to make that work, either x squared would be 0, or x would be 0, which I don't care about. Or a, if I set this equal to 0, 4a minus 1 equals 0, add the 1 over, we get 4a equals 1, or a equals 1 fourth. So now I have my a value here. a has to be 1 fourth, and now I can substitute that back into my problem here. So if I did that, you know, I'm going to start right here we get 4 times 1 fourth x squared minus 4x plus 4 times 1 fourth x minus x squared. That has to equal bx. I'm just going to use the original problem without the 0. So if I did this here, a fourth of 4 just becomes 1. So we have 1x squared minus 4x um, plus 4 times 1 fourth is just 1x and then minus x squared equals bx, and this does exactly what I wanted to. Now we have 1x squared minus 1x squared, so those two will reduce down to 0. So now I'm left with negative 4x plus 1x would be negative 3x equals bx. So b would have to be negative 3, because I just need this side to equal that side. Okay, so b is negative 3, and that would be choice b. All right, if you have any other questions or requests for a certain question that you want to see, please comment them below.